The Museum of the City of Athens is housed in two of the most beautiful old buildings in central Athens and was founded by Lambros Eftaxias and his uncle Alexandros Boros in 1973. The pink old palace part of the museum once belonged to the Vekozi Buru family and was the first Athenian residence of King Otto and Queen Amalia from 1836 to 1843. The second, grander looking building was built in 1859 and is nowadays connected to the old palace by a covered bridge. On the first floor, there are plenty of reminders that this was once a royal residence. Here is a handwritten copy of the Constitution of 1844 that was used by King Otto. One of the museum's most interesting paintings is this large-scale Athenian scene by Jacques Carré. In it we see the Parthenon depicted as it was in 1674, almost intact, before it was severely damaged ten years later by Venetian cannonballs. Wandering through the upstairs rooms really gives you a feel of how a wealthy Athenian family must have lived in the 19th and early 20th centuries. It should have been a pleasant, laid-back life, with plenty of time for tea parties, card games, dinner parties and music. The top floor houses temporary exhibitions and is currently showing the art of Mesolonghi. Leaving bustling, noisy Klathmonos Square by stepping through the doors of this museum, it's like travelling back through time to an era that suddenly seems made less remote by the small-scale reminder of a bygone age.